kicking off on Oasis, the Hunters began the first engagement on City Center with Hu Jinmo Yi raining rockets down towards the Spitfire. London flipped it back at 56%, with Jehu gesture Hong's Winston being too much for Chengdu as they won the first point 100-56%. On Gardens, the Spitfire were able to capture the point first off a hack and kill by Jung Young Prophet Park. Jinmu opened things up for the Hunters with a Farah ultimate taking out two members of the Spitfire and claiming the control at 25%. Prophet hacked Jinmu and eventually got the pick and flipped the map, making it 89 to 25. In a final push, Meikhan and Meng Ding scored an environmental kill on Zhang Shok Nus Kim, securing a 100 to 25 win. On University, though, the teams engaged in frantic team fights, trading control back and forth. With the score at 99 to 99, the Hunters found an advantage and used it to secure the map. The Hunters won Oasis on a final score of 2-1. The Hunters began Paris on defense with an Orisa and Torbjorn version of a bunker composition. Ji Hyuk, Birdery, and Kim really broke open the defense with a pick on Jinmu leading to a time bank of over 6 minutes going into point B. A Meng made critical mistakes by overextending and getting eliminated. His teammates soon followed as London captured point B very easily. With the Hunters on offense, they were met with a version of Somber Goats that they promptly ran over. Ultimates from Jinmu and Chengting Kyo Kong gained two ticks for the Hunters, but London was able to regroup and prevent a full capture. This would serve only to delay the inevitable as the Hunters forced extra time by capturing point B. Both teams completed the map in the first overtime, but London had time left on the clock. In double overtime, London played very passively, burning their time bank down to 25 seconds. The Hunters looked like they had the round one, but London managed to extend overtime and pull out an improbable win, tying the match overall 1-1. The London Spitfire won Paris on a final score of 5-4. Going into Eichenwald, it was all Chengdu. The Hunters started on offense quickly rolling London. With a time bank of more than 6 minutes, they pressed on. The Spitfire tried to flank behind the Hunters, but forgot to challenge for the cart. The Hunters captured the second point in short order soon after. The Spitfire put up a valiant fight on point C, holding on to the last few feet for nearly a minute before getting white. Jinmu managed to hold the Spitfire back with his fara, eroding London's time bank. As a team, the Hunters paired support ultimates with aggressive gameplay, pulling off a full hold. The Chengdu Hunters won Eichenwald on a final score of 3-0. The Hunters started their defense with a double sniper look while the Spitfire countered with a GOATS composition. While the 3-3 composition isn't flashy, it proved effective as the first point was captured quickly. Point B went much better for the Hunters as they knocked London completely off their game with Jinmu feasting as Doomfist. On offense, the Hunters faced off against a somber Goats composition. The momentum from the previous round seemed to carry over with Chengdu running London over. An EMP opened things up on point B, allowing the Hunters to approach London's mark on the map with 4 minutes left. Jinmu sealed the deal with a Fara ultimate and the Hunters won the map and subsequently the match on a final score of 3-1. Chengdu won Rialto on a final score of 2-1.